Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> um, we're in the car waiting for Chris, so I yeah, thought I'd do my gosh. intro here. We are going to... Um, oh, where are we going? I don't actually know lake. where... It, yeah, some sort of like rivery lake type thing. I can't even remember what it's called, where we're going. Um, something like Barker and Mills or something like that. Anyway, I'll tell you once we're there. <laughs> We know, I've never been here before, but we've got the paddleboard and we've got the kayak in the boot and we thought we would go along on the river and just take it out. We've got, got another family that we're going to. I've got a question. What's your question? This is about Avengers. Who do you think will win? Bucky or the Winter Soldier? Well, Bucky is the Winter Soldier. But if they got separated. Yeah, if they got separated. What, and Bucky didn't have his arm? No, no he, he did. He did. Oh. Um, Mm, I think that'd be quite a tough one. I think that'd be quite a 50 50 comment thing. Comment down below. Okay, Jamie wants you to comment down below who would win, Bucky or the Winter Soldier, in a fight if they got separated because they actually are the same character. Um, anyway, where are we going? What's it? Barker Mills. Bar Barker and Mills. Barkoom. Oh, Barkoom. Oh, Barkoom and Mills. We're meeting um, another family of friends of ours. So they've got a paddleboard as well. So we're all going to just go out. I've got Lulu because I'm probably just going to walk along the side, to be honest, on the river. Um, it's quite chilly. It's a beautiful day, but the wind is cold. So I thought I would just sacrifice the dipping in the water bit and I would just walk Lulu instead. So that's what we're doing now. And I thought I'd just film a little day in the life. It is Sunday today. I've already filmed some uh, for some work this morning. Actually, boys, Hello. we need to do your um, homework when you get home, don't we? Hello. So, yeah, just going to take you along with us. So, we're here. Where are we again, Leans? It's my friend Lena. I'm sure you guys know Lena. Bikem, Bikem. It's really nice. Look how still the yes, the, yeah, something like the Ouse River. God, we're really selling bright and well, aren't we? Um, but there's so many paddleboarders on the river. Um, but it's really quite chilly, so we're not too sure if we're going to get our paddleboard out. I've had to use the picnic blanket as my scarf because it's so so chilly. But the kids are having the best time. It's so nice being here. Oh. You nearly thought you were going in there. <laughs> so where we have parked, you literally like walk over a little bridge and then you come across this area here. And this is like the perfect launching bay bit for any paddleboarding or kayaking. This is, I think, where everyone seems to come here and like launch from. Is that what it's called? Launch? Um, it's perfect. Lulu's getting a bit freaked out because she's worried everyone's going missing in the paddleboard but look there's just like a little drop so you just pop your board down there and then you can just step out onto it it's perfect and it is just so lovely and peaceful huh? whoa this is cool not really no no wait frank are going first because he's the biggest and then you're getting around him i'll go at the back yeah frank needs to go in the middle probably Wait for Franco to get in, guys. <laughs> Woo! What was that? <laughs> I can't get in. Franco's legs are too long. Where are my legs? Here. Go on, sit down. Ready? Is that fun, Jay? <laughs> Whee!
Ah, oh, we have just got home. I feel absolutely exhausted. That was such a lovely afternoon though. We went in the water in the end. It was it was like really, really windy, but then we went and had a picnic and the kids just played. And then we were walking back to the car because we thought, oh, we'll just go home. And then suddenly we were like, it's actually really, really hot. So we found a really nice little spot that um, was like perfect to like launch from with your, like on your paddleboard and kayak and stuff. So we went there and we sat there for about an hour and a half and the kids were on the paddleboards by themselves. Like there were so many people out there. It was just so, so nice. Um, but yeah, absolutely exhausted now. I think I actually caught the sun a little bit. I have like this, oh, I'll show you the stuff that I use. It's actually really good. It's called Helio Care. I've been using it for the last couple of years and it's almost like a tinted moisturizer. And then, um, but it's factor 50 as well. So I put it on as almost like my foundation type stuff. So I don't use anything else. I just put that on and then it like protects me factor 50. Um, so I can go out in the sun and not have to worry about putting extra sun cream on my face, which is quite good. So, but yeah, still think like it definitely does, the sun definitely does still get through it. It shows like how strong the sun is, even though it's cold and it's windy. I'm gonna go and have a shower now because I feel so tired. The boys are watching football downstairs. They've already had a shower because they were a little bit wet when they got home. So they are watching some football downstairs and I'm gonna make beans on toast for dinner. Cannot for one second be bothered to cook a dinner. So I just said to the boys, are you happy with beans on toast? Literally, I think they must have heard like a takeaway or something because they were so excited to have beans on toast, which I'm pretty chuffed about. So I'm gonna jump in the shower and then I'll be back. What a dinner, I mean. That is gourmet. So this is what I've made for the boys. And then I have got some salmon in the air fryer over there for Chris and I. And I don't know what else we're gonna have with it, but it just needed to be cooked today. So delish, but honestly, watch how excited they're gonna be when I give this to them. <laughs> Bottom. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what have you got, Jay? Is that exciting? Does that look good? <laughs> so excited. I haven't really vlogged since, um, oh, I had a shower because um, I'll show you what's been going on. The builders have asked us to clear out the two front rooms, the playroom and the office, because they are going to be knocking down the bay windows in there tomorrow and um, they're going to board it all up and everything so that we can like have Obviously, the window's not there, but the boards will keep us in and the cold out a little bit. So, this is what's been going on this evening. Oh my gosh. I don't even, when are we going to. Well. Oh, did you, just, did you do all that? Well, I was, doing, I was actually doing some work. So, I'd say that we did this, but Chris did this. Oh, right. Yeah, but who's going to sort this out tomorrow? Yeah, but you've seen the empty room. Yeah, I'll show you the empty rooms in a minute. We need to sort this out tomorrow. So, this is what we're going to bed in like this now because tomorrow we can open up our container and then we can um sort all this out but i'm sure there's i'm sure there's stuff here that we don't need for my hairstyle <laughs> i mean this is just literally the beginning of it all we have so much to put in our container we're moving out in three and a half weeks now and our house still looks like we could live here apart from this bit because obviously this has just happened just like now so Chris is practicing his football skills in the boys' playroom now. I mean, the boys are actually trying to go to sleep. They've just gone upstairs and they've... This is Chris's football. Amazing. This whole, this whole house well, is going to be... This is not a room like this. This is miss. No, this is not... We've got an outside for this. We've decided actually, this room is going to be, this was always gonna be the cinema room. No, this was always gonna be the office, but we've decided this room is now going to be the cinema room because it's square and it will just be a lot better for the cinema room. So that's what we decided over this weekend. We decided to, oh, can you stop? Because the boys are going to sleep. God, sometimes he can be so irritating. 
I'm just making myself a little hot water and then I'm gonna go down and finish my work because I have got quite a few bits, like a few deadlines that I need to have done by tomorrow morning and they are not done and it is quarter to nine now and I need to really crack on. So I'm gonna end this video here. Thank you so much for watching. Just making Chris and I a little hot water and I think, Oh my gosh, you emptied the dishwasher. That's a nice surprise. Um, I've got some washing to hang up. I've got some washing to sort out. And then we're going to watch This Is Us. We're obsessed with This Is Us. And I haven't seen it for a couple of days now. And I feel like I'm getting withdrawal symptoms from it. If you haven't seen the series This Is Us, you've got to watch it. It's on, it's on Amazon Prime, isn't it? Yeah, it's on Amazon Prime, not on Netflix. And it is just the very best series ever. Definitely give it a watch. Right, off to sit down. Well, off to hang out my washing, then sit down. So I'll say goodbye and I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to watch Thursday's video because it will be the next installment of the home renovations. So I really hope you enjoy like watching along our series to see how our home gets completely destroyed, but to be built back looking even better. I'll see you guys then. Bye.